Okay, so I, I think I just saw something back here, so I thought I'd... Well, I don't think I'm... I'm 99% sure I... Okay, there's a truck sitting in the parking lot back there, right? And in the back of this truck is a salt spreader. A salt spreader? A salt spreader that you put in your trailer in your trailer hitch receiver and you fill it up with salt and you turn it on and you drive down your driveway or whatever and spread salt. We're in Florida. So I told her, I said, you're not going to believe me. I didn't even want to bring it up. Well, maybe they were going to put salt in their sand. We're going fishing. <laughs> okay, guys, sorry about the wind. It's very windy. We're on the Gulf of Mexico, Crystal River. We'll try to do some fishing so yeah I'm gonna get my body camera on I think I'm gonna go out here on the pier monkey usually fishes here we'll see what we can catch hang around guys okay guys sorry for the wind but I guess monkey yeah she's got a catfish all right I guess I gotta walk over there Guess she won't take it off the hook. Yeah. All right, I gotta get over there. Well, I didn't catch anything, but I do have a beautiful sunset here with a monkey's head in a picture. Very beautiful out here though. Nice. I did bring the drone, but it's pretty windy. We're gonna give it a few more minutes. See what happens. Got a duck trying to get my fish here. Ah, go away. Woo! Give me a catfish. Hey, do I got one? Yay! Give me a catfish. Got a catfish. Well, I didn't get stunk. You know? Stunk? Skunked? No, yeah, you did not. Cool. Yay! Okay, guys, so not much of a fishing day for me. I caught that one catfish. Had a lot of bites, but I did get snagged up once. Well, a couple times, but the last time I got snagged, I ended up pulling in somebody's fishing line. And when I do that, I always take it. There's a place right over there we put it in. And so, there you go. And so, uh, on the end of that line was a nice sinker. A steel leader and a hook so always not lost monkey caught a couple nice catfish and a um, red snapper so that's pretty cool uh, yeah I wish uh, wish we'd have caught a bunch more of them snappers but the red snapper has to be 10 inches long and I think I think the uh, the mangrove snappers have to be like 12 inches or something, wasn't it? So, yeah. It's been laying there all day. What is it? Microfiber cloth. Oh. It was clean. <laughs> but it's been run over. Good fishing rag. But here's... I'm going to show them this real quick. There's the ramp. Oh, there's two ramps. 
Um, well, technically four, you can fit two boats, two vehicles on each side. A little tight if you do that, but it can be done. So, that's nice out here, guys. Beautiful. So, when we get wheel bearings put on the trailer, we're going to bring our boat out here, and we're going to do some night fishing out in here. Probably back in there. I don't think we've been back that far. I know we've come back this way as we put in up there. And we come back this way a good ways, but we didn't come this far, so a lot of coves a few miles up that way, a lot of little channels you can get back in, do some night fishing. It's pretty cool, man. So anyway, guys, again, sorry that um uh, <laughs> I didn't catch anything but that one fish, but you know, a lot of people wouldn't even upload that, but you know, this is real life, you know. So and uh <laughs> So I was talking to Kenny. Hi, Kenny. <laughs> he was messaging or commenting while we was fishing. I told him I was trying to get some fish. She said, hi, Kenny. So, anyway, hi, Kenny. <laughs> Good talking to you, man. So, uh, yeah. In fact, he was, he was just getting ready to watch our stupid ones or funny stuff. Oh, yeah? Yeah. <laughs> so... All right, guys. We'll see you in the next one. Shea Bear's Myth Man, I'm le Myth the Man Legend. I'm gone for now. Monkey says she's out for now. Bye, y'all. Bye, guys. Appreciate you watching. We'll see you in the next one. Bye, bye.